Welcome to KetoMealsAndRecipes.com. Today I'm really happy to show you how to make Keto Nutella that tastes and has a smooth mouthfeel just like the store-bought Nutella. The macronutrient ratio for my Keto Nutella is 4.2 to 1 with 3.4 grams of total carbs, 2 grams of dietary fiber resulting in 1.4 grams of net carbs for each slightly heaping tablespoon or 20 gram serving. And if that wasn't enough reason for you to try my Keto Nutella, the best part of this recipe is it only takes about 5 minutes. I highly recommend you use a food processor rather than a blender or bullet. The reason this recipe is so quick to make is because we actually begin with a bit of a cheat. For this recipe, I used prepared 100% hazelnut butter that has no added sugars, preservatives, or any other ingredients other than just the hazelnuts and that will save you a lot of time. With the hazelnut butter you will only need a few additional ingredients to make your Nutella. So let's begin by first grinding our sweetener to a confectionery consistency. You want the sweetener to be as fine of a powder as you can get it because it will incorporate better and not have a granulated texture when you're done. Next I added the hazelnut oil and I use this because it enhances the taste of the hazelnut butter but if you don't have any hazelnut oil or can't get it, then you can substitute with either MCT oil, coconut oil, or even grapeseed oil. Next I added the Dutch processed cocoa powder and the salt. And lastly, I added the pure vanilla extract. Put the lid on and turn on your food processor and blend for about three to five minutes. You wanna keep blending until your Nutella has a really smooth, silky texture and a shiny gloss. You may also want to at least once stop and scrape down the sides. This will ensure that you get every last bit of ingredient fully incorporated. While it continues to blend, I'll also explain how you can use whole hazelnuts if you can't find the prepared hazelnut butter. The second best way to make this Nutella is to buy dry roasted and blanched hazelnuts. This means that the skins have already been removed. This will save you a lot of time and frustration trying to remove the outer brown skin. If you do get the dry roasted blanched hazelnuts, this method is also really easy. It just takes a bit longer and you need a good powerful blender to get a creamy nut butter. Just use the same weight of hazelnuts as you would have of the nut butter. Blend at high speed until smooth and creamy and then add the rest of the ingredients as I described earlier. And this is all there is to making my super easy, super quick Keto Nutella and also how to make the Nutella using whole hazelnuts. When you're done, whatever you haven't used up already, the rest of the Keto Nutella should be stored in an airtight glass jar and kept in the refrigerator. This will keep very well for about a month. That is if you can resist it for that long. Enjoy! In the next video, I will first show you how to make an authentic French crepe and then make the crepes we had in Vich, Croatia, which were Nutella and whipped cream filled palacinke. Lastly, I'm wondering if you would like to have me make a how to stay on keto while traveling video. This video would explain how we stayed on keto while traveling in the beautiful coastal areas of Croatia last summer. If you're interested, I could also recreate some of the meals we enjoyed during our travels in Croatia. Please let me know in the comments below if this is something you would be interested in. Thank you for watching this video. Please forward this video to someone you know who may also like it. Forwarding and sharing a link is the best way to help me grow this channel and I would really appreciate that. Please turn on your notification bell and I hope to see you next time. The link for the printable recipe is available in the description below.